I had this idea in my head for a very long time and I wanted to create a mini documentary highlighting the beauty of the, you know, the work of these amazing women. I love uh, what they do, what I see, and also I wanted to have the opportunity to, you know, spend time with them and share, you know, experiences, the good, the bad, advice, you name it. So everything that we spoke here will definitely will stay here with us. This mini documentary will show the beauty of their work and how we never stop learning, we never stop uh, sharing, we never stop uh, being creative. And this is a tribute to all the women to inspire them to continue with their journey, even if you think it is too hard or you want to give up. So I hope this will be a motivation or an extra boost for you to continue. Ik ben Maaike en ik ben de eigenaresse van Pictures by M. Hi, I'm Karen. I'm from Landgraaf and I'm a food photographer. Hi, ik ben Stephanie Marappi. Ik ben fotograaf. Ik focus me op jonge gezinnen en families. En daarnaast heb ik passie voor food fotografie ontwikkeld, die ik ja, echt fantastisch vind. Hi, I'm Karin de Bruin. I'm a food and lifestyle photographer. And uh, since last year, I started also to do some uh, personal branding uh, photo shoots. And uh, yeah, that's what I do mostly work for brands. Ik ben Sarah van der Weert. Uh, ik ben een hobbyfotograaf. Uh, ik hou van uh, stil levens en uh, architectuur. I'm Daisy. I'm a food photographer and a studio owner. Hola, soy Yasmin Sanchez. Soy fotógrafa de retratos y productos. Hi, I'm uh, Marit van Eikenburg. I'm a macro photographer and I love to shoot bugs. I think I have a few ones, but I worked for a, a magazine in Rotterdam and first time you see the, your pictures on a magazine really on paper, it's really, it's really a nice feeling. Precies, eigenlijk is alles speciaal, want het moment dat ze je boeken Dat is al fantastisch, want dan vinden ze je werk geweldig. Uh, een van de leukste momenten in mijn carrière is geweest dat er contact met me is opgenomen door een glazenmerk. Ze benaderde me om foto's te maken voor een social media en stuurde me daarvoor ook glazen op. En dat vind ik gewoon super leuk om te doen. Cocktails fotograferen vind ik heel leuk om te doen. Dus dat was echt het toppunt. Een uh, very special moment voor mij was mijn eigen photo studio, because it meant that I could change my home situation. So home is home now, work is work. And it's just more professional. It's an own space where I can create magic with other food photographers as well. Uh, for me, the special moment is when I met people who like the same thing as I do. And uh, we can relate to the things we like and then work together. Definitely, especially for my field, it's very, it's about insects, it's about small, scary, creepy creatures. But normally are more a subject um, of, I guess, male interest. And I think about 95% of the people who do macro photography, and especially insect photography, are male. So, um, me doing this kind of photography, I might show other people and also show uh, little girls like hey you can also do this and insects are cool and amazing creatures and it's not just a boys club it's also something for uh, women to enjoy. Photography is really about creativity and uh, to transform of to transcript your creativity in something other people can use or find it beautiful so and women in general are really creative. Women are have a different sense of creativity, have a different way to use their creativity. And hand van een vrouw uh, geraakt wordt, vind ik altijd meer creatief en meer uh, persoonlijk. Dus ik denk dat wel uh, de fotografie ook uh, vrouwen nodig hebben. I think women are more creative. They look more to details, colors, uh, make better compositions, and 
They have other logic. Sigo a muchas mujeres en Instagram eh, que son fotógrafas y positivamente hay mucho cambio. Creo que estamos más incluidas en este campo o en este mundo fotográfico y están aportando cosas muy positivas. Ik denk dat er op het moment meer vrouwelijke fotografen zijn omdat ze door elkaar worden gestimuleerd en zien van de een, oké, okay, die kan dat, dat kan ik ook. En dat het wat makkelijker is tegenwoordig dan dat het voorheen was met een gezin in thuis en huishouden en dat soort dingen. Just do it, because if I can do it, you can do it too. And everybody has his own specialty, so find yours. Als je echt um, uh, gepassioneerd bent um, in wat je wil gaan doen, dan moet je het gewoon doen en ervaren en um, oefenen, oefenen, oefenen. Totdat je er bent, dat je er blij mee bent. Just do it. Rodeate de personas que estén en la misma sintonía, que estén haciendo lo mismo que estás haciendo tú. Puedan darte, uh, echarte una manito, levantar el ánimo, llamarte y hacer una colaboración. También es importante. Just do what you like and what your heart says to do. Follow your heart. I think that you must yourself sign and then and do it. Do. Just do it. Because if you don't do it today, you will not do it tomorrow. And you will not do it the day after. And you will have to start somewhere, which is perhaps very bad. But every day when you do it, it gets better. Wat ik zou adviseren voor beginnende fotografen is gewoon heel veel uitproberen. Verschillende takken van de fotografie, foodfotografie, interieurfotografie, modelfotografie. En kijken wat het beste bij jou past. I would say don't let anything hold you back. Don't see something as, oh, I cannot do this, or hey, isn't that something scary or too difficult for me? No, just go out and do it. And if it's just for boys or for men, no, no, no. Just you can do it too. And don't let anything hold you back in that regard. <laughs>